Warning, this video contains images of feral pests being shot using a rifle of suitable calibre. Please do not watch if you are likely to be offended. Furthermore, if you make any comments that are either negative, political or religious, they will be removed from my channel. So we are back out for another visit to one of my permissions, and this time Bob couldn't make it, so I have my backup Bob. That sounds a little wrong. We'll call him Bruce. Anyway, it was his first night out on the rats, and he's still getting used to pressing record before he takes a shot. So sadly, we didn't get any video from his scope. This is unfortunate, but we still had a good night out. Once again, my setup is my FX Impact M3 chambered in .22 with the ATN 4K Pro 3x14 scope and the ABL ballistic laser. I'll be running the JSB Hades at 15.89 grains. Some of you might recognise Bruce's setup. It's my old FX Crown, also chambered in .22 with the ATN 4K Pro 3x14 scope and the ABL ballistic laser. He's running the JSB Jumbo Heavies. So let's get right into it and we'll start off with a few pigeons. This guy was a little stubborn, so it took more than one shot to get him to go down. And this guy wasn't stubborn, he was just downright rude. He wouldn't stay still long enough in a clear open spot for me to get a clean shot at him. I can almost hear you screaming at your computer for me to take the shot. But, as the bird's moving so erratically, I can't guarantee a clean ethical kill. But when he did stay still long enough, the shot was perfect. And speaking of perfect shots, they don't get much better than this. These two birds didn't go down like the last one, but they went to the ground fairly quickly on the other side of the shed. That's enough of the pigeons. Let's take out a few rats and we'll start off with a Texas enema. Yeah. 
I think this one was a case of small rat side pocket. That one's dead. Yes, he is. Oh, so I'm just Due to community standards, some viewing had to be censored. Who am I trying to kid? Of course this is going to get shown on my channel. In fact, let's see it in slow motion. Rule number five. Show no love. Love will get you killed. This guy was playing a little hard to get, so I had to wait for my shot. But when I did, it was a nice clean headshot. 
Headshot. This guy wasn't giving me much of a target, but I could see his eyes shine and I knew there was a solid backstop behind him. So I took the shot and down he went. And going by all the twitching behind the bushes, I think it might have been a headshot. I constantly get asked what do we do with all the dead rats and pigeons. Well, we pick them up. We collect them using paratongs so we don't actually handle the dead bodies. We place them in a bucket and once the bucket gets full, we dump them on the compost pile like the farmer has asked us to do so. <sighs> Sorry. Are we keeping you up, Bruce? Well, this video is almost over, but I couldn't leave you without a little bit of rapid fire now, could I?
Well that's it for rapid fire, and this is the last rat for the night, because I think they're ready to hoist the white flag. Well, for Bruce's first night out, he did quite well. Apart from the recording problems, but it did take me quite a while to train Bob up to record his shots. I'm sure we'll see more from Bruce over the next year. Who knows, maybe I could get Bob and Bruce out for a threesome. Once again, that just sounded wrong. Thanks again for watching. If you like my videos, please hit the like and subscribe button. To get notifications of new videos, click on the bell. And until next time, please stay safe, keep calm and gently squeeze the trigger.